तो दोस्तों आइए बात करते हैं क्वेश्चन सिंपल इंटरेस्ट का है काफी मजेदार है आइए बात करते हैं इसके बारे में सी क्वेश्चन कुछ यू है कि असम ऑफ रुपीज टेन तो टेन रुपीज जो है वो आपने किसी को उधार दिए और उसने आपको वापस करे इलेवन मंथली इंस्टॉलमेंट में उसने कहा कि मैं आपको हर महीने पैसे दूंगा ग्यारह महीने का फॉर इलेवन मंथ एंड फॉर एवरी मंथ ही पेड यू रुपी वन और उसने हर एक महीने में एक रुपया वापस किया तो बोले तो वो भी सिंपल इंटरेस्ट पे तो ये बताओ कि रेट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट कितना था वॉट इज द रेट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट ओके so if if you try to understand the question what is the story behind it let's talk about that as well okay so main sochu agar to is like ki agar 11 mahine ki main baat karu to they are like january february march april may june july august september october चलो किसी तरीके से आ गए सारे ओके ना दैट्स अ गुड जॉब नाउ ऑब्वियसली इफ यू सी दैट ही टुक रुपीस 10 राइट एंड ही इज टॉकिंग अबाउट फॉर फर्स्ट 11 मंथ दिस इज फर्स्ट मंथ एंड दिस इज द 11th मंथ राइट सो ही इज पेइंग रुपी 1 रुपी 1 एवरी टाइम एवरी टाइम ही इज पेइंग रुपी 1 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 इट्स अ लूप पे चला रहा है चलता रहे लूप सो आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट कि इफ यू हैव गिवन 1 1 रुपी एवरी टाइम ऑन एवरी मंथ सो व्हाट विल हैपन इज कि आप अगर सोचें कि यार ये जो जनवरी वाला महीना है इसी में तो उसने उधार लिए होंगे पैसे इन द मंथ ऑफ जनवरी इटसेल्फ ही टुक द मनी सो ऑब्वियसली वो वापस कर रहा है वन रुपी इस महीने में जनवरी के महीने में तो इस पर कोई इंटरेस्ट नहीं देना पड़ता उसको ओके okay? तो इस पर कोई इंटरेस्ट नहीं देना पड़ता जनवरी के महीने में सो इट डज नॉट नीड टू गिव एनी इंटरेस्ट ऑन दी मंथ ऑफ जनवरी ओके बट इफ आई टॉक अबाउट फेब्रुवरी ऑब्वियसली ही इज गिविंग वन रुपी आफ्टर वन मंथ सो ही विल बी चार्ज इंटरेस्ट ऑफ वन मंथ सो हियर इंटरेस्ट विल बी चार्ज ऑफ वन मंथ for the whole 30 days of january okay interest of one month now again if i talk about march for march the amount is due from january to march so the amount has been due from like two months by january se february or feb se march yani ki do mahine mein usne paisa nahi diya do mahine ke baad ja kar ke paisa diya to do mahine tak uska paisa due tha so obviously is liable to pay the interest of two months तो दो महीने तक उसको इंटरेस्ट देना पड़ेगा तो यहां पर वो इंटरेस्ट देगा इस एक रुपए पर कितना इंटरेस्ट देगा इंटरेस्ट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट ऑफ टू मंथ सेम गोज फॉर अप्रैल इफ आई टॉक अबाउट अप्रैल ऑब्वियसली द अमाउंट इज ड्यू फॉर जनवरी फरवरी मार्च सो द अमाउंट इज ड्यू फॉर थ्री मंथ्स एंड ही हैज टू पे द इंटरेस्ट फॉर थ्री मंथ्स व्हेन ही इज पेइंग दैट 1 रुपए इन अप्रैल सो ऑब्वियसली इफ आई टॉक अबाउट द इंस्टॉलमेंट ऑलवेज रिमेंबर इंस्टॉलमेंट कैसे बनाता है कोई दुकान में ठीक है इंस्टॉलमेंट में क्या होता है फाइट अबाउट इंस्टॉलमेंट इट इंक्लूड्स टू थिंग्स ऑब्वियसली द इंटरेस्ट ऑफ दैट मंथ तो इंटरेस्ट इंक्लूड होता है इंस्टॉलमेंट में एंड द सेकंड थिंग इज अ पार्ट ऑफ प्रिंसिपल अब ऑब्वियसली सारा प्रिंसिपल पे कर रहे होते तो इंस्टॉलमेंट ही बनते राइट अ पार्ट ऑफ प्रिंसिपल तो प्रिंसिपल का कुछ हिस्सा होता है ठीक है फॉर एग्जांपल कि इफ आई टेक 100 रुपए लोन और मैं बोला भाई 10 महीने में दे दूंगा ठीक है तो दस महीने के हिसाब से दस दस रुपए बनते हैं पर आपको दस दस रुपए नहीं देने हैं देव लाइक कि यार अगर मान लो हंड्रेड पर टेन परसेंट का इंटरेस्ट हो के वन टेन होता है तो देव पे यू लाइक कि इलेवन इलेवन रुपीस देते हैं अब उसमें कुछ प्रिंसिपल होगा हर महीने और कुछ इंटरेस्ट होगा और हर एक महीने का सेम नहीं होता बिकॉज ऑफ द टाइम पीरियड इफ यू लुक एट द टाइम ऑफ मार्च ऑब्वियसली द अमाउंट इज यू फॉर टू मंथ्स तो इधर वाला इंटरेस्ट ज्यादा है इधर वाला इंटरेस्ट तो इसीलिए इधर प्रिंसिपल की जो क्वान्टिटी है वो कम होगी and uh, sorry jada ho gayi sorry 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 jada ho gayi the amount of the principal will be higher here and the amount of the principal will be lower here and as far as i go into the months from like january to november obviously the quantity of the principal will reduce and the amount of the interest will obviously increase okay so around this story we'll try to solve our question i hope that you get a uh, story behind it what is happening in the question okay let's talk about the question so let's talk about how to solve the question obviously i know that i have taken sum of rupees 10 it means this should be principal right principal is rupees 
principal is equal to rupees m okay what is given more to me obviously i know that talking about 11 months and every time is paying for me like rupee 1 right so one thing is clear to me that after 11 months i will get 11 rupees that's a clear statement by for the question right ye to mere ko clear hai ki boss ek ek rupaya milega har mahina to january to november mein kya rupaye ikatthe ho jayenge kya rupaye ka sabood mil raha hai kya mus cheez hai chale to i will mention the amount which is like 11 okay so if i mention the amount obviously the amount is equal into like 11 so that is also the Now obviously between this principal and amount the difference is called the interest right but the gap of the principal and amount is called the interest as everybody know it okay i'll mention it as well okay see what is basically interest what is interest interest is basically how large amount is than principal what's the difference between them how extra money you earn right So basically, you earn rupee one extra, right? That's your interest. Now the question becomes very, very easy. Okay, I obviously know interest, so I I can say that if I talk about the interest, which is spread in eleven months, that's the beauty of the question, right? That's the beauty of the question. See, so you'll be like, "Ki boss, me ko pata hai ki if I talk about this, obviously I know if I talk about the month of January, obviously." In the month of January, he is not paying any interest, because obviously, जैसे ही उसने उधार लिया एक रुपया दे दिया that is called down payment. अगर आप कभी लोगे उधार पर कोई चीज, so obviously you get to know that that is called down payment the amount you pay initially. Okay, so obviously you don't need to pay any interest in the month of January, which is rupee one. From February, you'll have to pay interest of like one month, right? So you'll say that if I talk about the interest, if I talk about the interest now, yeah, and maybe whatever you want to write now. Obviously, interest. Yeah, you can say like total interest. Okay, say like total interest. Total interest. Okay, earned in eleven months. See, like no earned in eleven months. Earned in eleven months. And obviously, you know that is equals to eleven. Uh, that is equals to one, right? Because one is the interest now in the question. Now let's talk about the question. So obviously, if I know if I talk about the month of February, if I talk about Feb, 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 if I write the next time. Obviously, now I have talked about this February, and now we'll talk about March. Okay. So if I talk about March, basically it's like you again you give you are giving one rupee, but obviously the amount is due for like two month. Con con sa January or February, two months ke liye paisa due hai. So obviously you'll do take the interest of two months here, right? And then you'll take the interest of three months, and then four months, and then it will keep going on and on and on till the month of November. Or in November, your amount will be due for ten months, right? Obviously, for ten months, right? If people don't understand how is it ten months, so yeah, obviously January. They go January. November ka thodi doge na. So pehle pehle ka doge na. January, Jan, Feb, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October. So ye dus mein ho jayenge aapke. से चलता रहेगा चलता रहेगा इट विल कीप कंटिन्यू ऑन एंड ऑन एंड ऑन एंड देयर बी अ टाइम व्हेन यू पे अ इंटरेस्ट ऑफ आर परसेंट फॉर लाइक 10 मंथ्स राइट फॉर लाइक 10 मंथ्स एंड द टोटल इंटरेस्ट बीइंग द वन नाउ ऑब्वियसली एज वी ऑल नो व्हाट इज कॉल्ड डिस्ट्रीब्यूटिव प्रॉपर्टी वेयर वी ट्राई टू टेक द थिंग्स कॉमन तो अगर मैं ऐसा करने की कोशिश करूंगा तो मेरे को क्या लग रहा है मेरे को ये दिख रहा है कि बॉस ये 100 सब में सब में आएगा आर सब में आएगा This R and hundred will be there all around the question, right? Obviously twelve as well. I have said everyone twelve should divide here. So twelve R and hundred. I will take everything common. If I do so, if I take R upon twelve hundred common, in bracket I will be left with one, which is here, then two, which is here, and then obviously three, which is which is not written by me. 
Okay, so I will say like 3 and then like 4 and obviously it will keep continuing on and on and on and on and on till like 10, okay. Now question becomes really really simple, okay. Obviously those people who don't know how to add the natural numbers, so there is a specific formula for it. I would love to mention it, you can try it at your homes. So basically the formula for adding natural numbers is like the uh, count, how are the natural numbers, see. There are 10 natural numbers. So the formula is n which is 10 then n plus 1 by 2. So if I do like 10, 10 plus 1 which is 11 by 2 it will be 55 right. So I will be like here r by 1200 multiplied by 55 which is eventually equals to 1 okay which is eventually equals to 1. Now the equation becomes really really simple dude you just need to solve it right and we all know how to solve it. So let's solve it. So it will be like key, uh, if the value of r is like the 1200 will go into the numerator because of cross multiplication or you can say the linear equation format and 55 will go into the denominator. Now if I try to cancel them out, if I try to cut them out, what will happen? Now I know that they are going to divide from 5 to 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 5 and obviously I have taught the ninja technique from 5 to 5 to 5 to 5 to 5 to 5 to 5 जो भी नंबर उसका डबल कर दो एक जीरो गार्ड कर दो तो ये जाएगा 240 तो 240 बाय 11 परसेंटेज आ जाएगा आपका इफ यू वांट टू राइट इट इनटू द मिक्स फ्रैक्शन ऑब्वियसली देन राइट इट आई डोंट हैव एनी सोर्ट ऑफ प्रॉब्लम इन दैट बट दिस इज द आंसर एवरीवन सो आई होप यू ऑल आर एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड Let's talk about it in the class as well. Thank you everyone. Thank you sir.